Finally, we have no real army anymore. The army is down to perhaps, what, 450,000. How much of that is ready to fight is open to debate. Much of it is sitting in Eastern Europe right now. We, we don't have the means to rapidly ship a large force of 80 to 100,000 troops on the ground into the region, which means that we're reliant on special forces and right now 2,000 Marines and perhaps 2,000 special forces and special operations forces. That's not going to make much of a dent. And as we've seen quite recently within the last 24 hours or so, uh, some of our special ops forces and Israeli special ops forces went into Gaza to reconnoiter, to plan for where they might want to go to free hostages and, and make an impact. And they were shot to pieces and took heavy losses, as I understand it. I think that's where we're headed. And I don't see that as a win for Israel in any way, shape or form. And I certainly think it's very dangerous for us.